Hello, this is Briar, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for 911 Operator. We are continuing our run here in Anchorage, Alaska. And uh, I don't know, so far I've been having some fun with this game. Uh, I'm still recording this all the same same uh, session as the very, very first episode. You can't tell from the shirt. Uh, so I actually don't know how the reaction is to these. Uh, again, it's not going to be a very long series. Uh, it's going to be a little bit longer than I thought, because these chapters are a little bit longer than I thought. But it's not going to be like a super, super long series. It's just something fun, something simple to play. Try something different that I haven't done before. So hopefully everybody's okay with that. All right, here's the rundown of our last mission. Pretty good. No, no negatives. In fact, I don't know if we had any zeros even. Uh, nope, we had one zero, a loud party, and that was it. Otherwise, really good. Uh, good rewards. Gets a good chunk of money. Gets good promotions. Looking pretty decent. Hopefully our placement are back. Nope, they're still injured. Okay, so I guess every... Every duty is a day. So we've actually got several days before these guys come back. That is fine. Um, it's interesting that they unmarked police cars a little faster than the police car itself. It's a fireman's pickup. I don't know that we really feel like we need the fireman's pickup that much. It is faster than all the other ones. Um, so it's definitely an option. We just want another fire kind of technical fire thing running around. I might even like deck this thing out with another person at some point. And then I think the well, the fire truck, connect, the fire pickup can also have four people. Interesting. I don't know. I don't feel like I need the fireman's pickup that much. I don't feel like we've had a lot of. So this one actually lacks the professional tools. 50,000 bucks. I don't think I want to spend 50,000 bucks on that. I'd rather save it for like the helicopter or something like that. So I think we're good as is. Honestly, don't know if I feel the need to buy anything right now. Any new equipment that we haven't tried out? No, not really. Uh, I mean, I can start decking out build Prevest to all my police officers, I suppose. Although these guys are already kind of decked out with like technical equipment and things of that nature. Okay, my firefighters <laughs> bullet Prevest. I, I think we're okay, honestly. Um, we'll get these two police officers back and they'll be able to deck out these last two cars and I think we're gonna be fine. I mean, last what, what did we miss the most of the last session? Honestly, it was medical. I mean, another medical setup would be a good idea. I guess I could do a medical car. Perfect for less serious cases when hospitalization is not needed. Well, it does have a place for somebody. So I suppose you could technically carry somebody in the car if you had to. Maybe we take out the car for now. No, that's 80,000 bucks. Goodness, that's more expensive than... Just buying us another one of these. I wish this was cheaper. I wish this rescue vehicle was cheaper. Because I feel like it should be cheaper than the medical transport. Because medical transport feels like it's just more decked out, right? Yeah, I don't know. I want more medical. But I don't know if I want any of these medical. I could just take the medical bike and just send it for like those epilepsy and things like that. That's not bad idea. It's only 20000 bucks. That is actually not a terrible idea. And eventually maybe I can move that over to the, cop the helicopter. You know what? I think I like that. I think we're going to grab this because I feel like medical is one of the things that we're just suffering. Now this won't be able to transport people, but like the epilepsies and things of that nature, they'd be able to zip around and kind of do some of that. So we will need to get somebody, probably somebody who's good at driving. I mean, I've heard motorcycles are <laughs> a little bit hard to drive. Um, you know, honestly, Logan Edwards here looks good to me. Grab Logan, put you in there. Um, I don't know that you even need any equipment specifically. Right? Because you're going to be able to have... I mean, you're going to be able to heal people just fine. I don't think you need the first aid kit. I mean, it is universal equipment. I don't know why you would... Oh, it speeds up the process of healing. Oh. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, then we're going to buy a bunch of first aid kits. We're going to buy one for these even. One, two, three, four. We'll grab, we'll grab four of those. I did not realize that it sped up the process of healing. 
Uh, I'm going to give it to you, just in case the defibrillator person needs to do something. I'll give this to you, and then I will give this to Logan down here. Okay, I think that actually will work out just fine. Technical tools, I don't know that we need. Fire extinguisher, I don't know. I don't know that we need any of this other stuff for Logan. I think he's fine with just the first aid kit. I like it. All right, let's go. Save the rest of the money for the helicopter at some point. Um, Where is Logan? Not there. He's probably up here. Yeah, there he is. So we're going to send... Actually, we're going to send you down here. I feel like we get a lot of epilepsies down this way for some reason. Uh, so we'll send you kind of down that area. And we'll just move you kind of up further up that way, maybe. Something like that. They look, that feels pretty spread out. Let's go with that. Um, technical? Technical. Um, I guess we'll just send you. That's fine. It's going to send a police car, but honestly, we'll get there just fine. We really rarely need the fire trucks. Obviously, this would be a perfect job for the pickup truck. Car accident occurred. Don't know the cause. I'll send you down there. Waiting for orders. Right away. And I'll rotate. Well, I'll rotate you just a little higher up. Nine one one. What's your emergency? There was an incident in my factory. One of my employees got stabbed by a sharp tool. Uh oh. What's the address you're calling from? <laughs> Alright, we're going to send you there. Obviously, we're going to send an ambulance as no. well. Are you endangered? Do you need police assistance? Police? Uh, no, no, no police. We just need an ambulance. What exactly happened to your employee? He fell off a ladder and stabbed himself with a knife while falling. I understood. I'll send an ambulance there. Okay, so the ambulance is coming, but it's a little ways away, so we'll send that guy. That'll be good to get a head start. Um, we're going to put you a little bit more central. We might not even need the... Well, we probably will need the ambulance. Okay, this is a technical job. Going to jump off of the bridge. Okay, let's, let's not. Let's not, dude. Seriously. All right, transport's coming. You're good. What is this? Lost consciousness. I guess we'll send you there. I'm actually going to send the police car down here because they, they can help with a little bit of that. Alright, is this a technical job? It is. Alright, you're done. Let's come up that way a little bit more. Police, this is car was speeding. Motorcycle, go help out. Injured on board. Nine one one. What's your emergency? Hey, there was a robbery. Where did this happen? Around. Do you have any injuries? Yes, I was hit badly. Where were you hit? My head. I'm bleeding. Okay. I want you to just stay there and wait until the ambulance arrives. Sure. Did they have any weapons? Yeah, a gun. Are your attackers still in the area? I have no idea. They ran away somewhere. All right, sir. We'll take care of it. Just wait for emergency services to arrive. Yeah, I will. All right, we got a uh, dog was bitten, has bitten a person. So let's send our dog. Ha! Um, and then we will send you there, and I think that'll be fine. Uh, what is this? This is a technical job. You are fine, I guess. This is a epilepsy attack, which is actually perfect for this guy. Uh, and then you will go up to the dog attack. This is probably a speeding or oh, drunk driver. Okay. Affirmative. 
Alright, motorcycle come down this way, please. Okay, head over this way. This is a red light offense. What are the affirmative? 911, what's your emergency? Hello? Dude, we have a serious mess here. What's the location of the fight? Okay, what's happening? Mets fans are beating up the other fans. I, I thought it's going to be this kind of, you know, friendly brawl, but our boys are pushing it a bit too far. C can you send an ambulance or something? Is anyone severely injured? Well, not severely, but some of them are pretty messed up. Few are actually unconscious. One of ours as well. What do you mean by ours? I'm rooting for Mets guys, obviously. <laughs> Well, I'm staying out of the fight. No, no, I don't want to say who's winning. <laughs> Just focus on what's going on right now, this fight that's happening in front of you. Well, that's all. Ours are giving them hell so far. Okay, sir, I've got officers on the way. They're going to break up the fight and deal with the situation. Be quick about it. This is putting a needle in his arm. We head down there. What are the Hot car reporting? head over there. We're done here. Standing reporting. Uh, actually, you can head down there too, but. We're under fire. Keep back up. Need uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh, fire truck. Okay, that's a technical. What are the orders? Ten four. I mean, these guys do have fire extinguishers, so they should be fine. What is this? This is a car bump. You can just head up there. Do you really need backup? Like seriously? Is it that bad? I got four heavily armed officers. Surely that's enough. Uh, sharp tool injury, massive blood loss. Um, you head there first. We will need to get the ambulance there in a minute. Okay, you're good. So you can go ahead and head there. You head up that way. Okay, it's just a fire now. Which these guys should be able to handle. Yeah, they're handling. Okay, so we're good. This is an epilepsy attack, so you're actually perfect for that, I believe. We usually don't have to transport those. Let's spread the police officers out a little bit. Uh, spread the fire trucks out a little bit. There is a heart attack. Um, can you make it to the heart attack, my friend? Nope, sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I, was, not, I was paying attention to this here. <laughs> Where are you calling from? I say, please be up here. Perfect. What's on fire? The counter. I accidentally threw a cloth on the burner, and the fire spreads quickly. Okay. Do you have a fire extinguisher? No. Okay. Get yourself and anyone else that's in the house out of the house now. The fire department will be there soon. Okay. Probably could use the damp cloth, but I know you don't want to put water on it because it could be an oil fire. But the damp cloth, I can't remember if that's. I actually don't remember if that's okay or not. Reporting. Let's move you down this way. You're good. Okay, you guys are all good. You're up, up, uh, what are you? Oof, critical, and that's a long ways away from where we're at. We'll send the motorcycle to see if he can help a little bit. But the ambulance is a ways away, unfortunately. Pedestrian hit by a car. This is, uh, just drugs? SWAT team! Speeding. We'll send the car. 911, what's your emergency? Send people here. Now! And... <laughs> Okay, sir. What happened? A plane has crashed into a house. Oh, no. Is anything on fire? There's some smoke coming out of the rooftop, but I can't see the flames. Can you tell if there's anyone inside the house? No. A, a woman ran outside. She, she said she was alone, and she's not injured. But I, I can tell she's in deep shock. What type of plane? A large one or a small one? A small one. I guess. Is there anyone else there who's injured? 
think whoever was in the plane is dead, but I'm not sure. I can't see them. Can you make it through to see if there's any survivors? Y you sure I should go in there? Not if there's any danger to you in any way, okay? Then I better stay. Send someone here quick. Okay, emergency services are on the way. They should be there soon. Hurry! I'm listening right away. Alright, um... We do need to send an ambulance over there. You're doing the heart attack. You're doing the... Okay, you're still pretty injured. What about you? Looks like you're going to be resolved here in a moment, so I'm going to send you here. Oh, we got a lot going on here. I'll do the other fire truck over there too, just just to be helpful. Okay, I was going to say, you might need transport up here, which you do. You are a broken bone by falling. Um, this guy will can help there in a second. You're not anywhere. Go help this guy, and we'll send... We'll have to send something over there in a second. Oh, we actually do need police up there, huh? Okay. Um, just you guys go up there. It's going to be fine. You should be able to stop on your way by without too much issue. I'm right away. 113 Lieutenant, I'll just get 1011 on 1650 Sutton. Ready for the next case. On my way to hospital. All right, actually, that's the last case. All right, cool. Not bad. Not bad. A couple plus fives, not bad. Cool. A couple promotions as well. Several promotions. Uh, one injury, unfortunately, so we'll have to deal with that. Oh, it's actually James. Uh, how much, I don't know how you got injured. Were you in that fight or something? Was that what it was? Or maybe you got hurt trying to battle one of the fires or something. Decent chunk of money. Not not too bad. But, uh, yeah. Let's get on to the next one. Chapter 4. Above the scale. Alright, so... Oh, was, I think I said James. I think I said... I was thinking Logan, because he, had the, he has the beard, too. But I guess it's just this guy up here. Um, do we want to go short-staffed? You got one more day, you've got one more day, you've got four more days. Um, actually what we can do is we can spread you out. So, we will put you... doesn't really matter. We'll move this over to you, or actually you probably. We'll move you up to there, and then we will give you the chest thing. Okay, any new equipment? We do have lots of new equipment, wow. Search and rescue vest. Firefighter mask. Uh, I mean, I definitely feel like we should be giving some of the firefighter stuff out. In fact, I would say we probably should get four of these. So at least two firefighters in each of these has the firefighter equipment. As far as search and rescue, I probably will buy a search and rescue thing for this guy. In fact, I probably will buy two. For these guys. I might eventually dish them out to someone else differently, but for now that's going to be probably my main search and rescue crew. Um, I could definitely see moving like a pickup truck and stuff like that. They can travel a little bit faster for that kind of thing. Or one of, maybe even the quad. Ooh, we got a ladder truck. We got a field hospital. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. These are all super expensive, though. I mean, we're not far off from being able to get, like, the ladder truck or something like that. Um, oh, there's a search and rescue helicopter. Nice. And a police copter. We got all sorts of things. This is get, I mean, there's a lot of cool stuff. We're, we're not financially able to get most of it, but it's still pretty cool to see all these things. No, I think we're okay with what we got. Um, once we start getting our, our cops back, that'll help a lot. This is off stuff a lot. I think this guy's been, I, I think this guy helped out a lot, honestly. This guy on the little medic bike, I think he was awesome. I mean, maybe we should just get like a little quad, then go do some search and rescue type stuff. It's not super expensive. It would be able to have a lot of like little things. 
No, I think I'm going to save my money. We're going to try and save our money. All right. Well, let's go. But this is a new chapter, so this is going to be... I guess that last one was a new chapter, wasn't it? Where is it this one? I don't remember now. Uh, whatever the case is, it's going to be... The new chapter is going to be definitely some new stuff, I'm sure. I want to save up for the, one of the helicopters. Honestly, I don't know which one, but one of them for sure. Just because I think they're cool. So what's the objective to here? Help link uh, searches conducted in big areas. Yeah, I mean, I feel like the, if we're going to get one of these two, I feel like we just get the police copter, right? This was a little bit faster, but we can't have everything. We, we, we're Anchorage, Alaska. We don't have that much money, right? I actually don't know how much money Anchorage, Alaska has. I think we're okay on, on everything. I could hire more people to fill in some of the gaps here and there. But honestly, I think we're mostly okay. Yeah, it's going to start the point. We'll find out. I may be wrong. We may get in here and be like, oh, no, we're missing so much stuff. You're down there. You're all good. I think I'm okay with all of this. Let's go. All right, we got a speeding. Um, we'll just send you over there. You're pretty close. This is a technical job. I mean, you're still the closest, so we'll send you over there. Nine one one. What's your emergency? Uh, hello. There was a car collision. Where did the collision happen? Are there any injuries? Yes, one person is injured. Can you tell what kind of injuries they have? One of the passengers says his stomach hurts really bad. Okay, just make sure they don't move until the ambulance arrives. Sure. Are any of the vehicles blocking traffic? No, they're not. When did it happen? Uh, five minutes ago. Do you know who caused the accident? All right, sir. Please wait for the emergency services to arrive. Okay. Thank you. Obviously drunk. All right, we'll send the police cars up there, too. There's a drunk driver right there. Uh, we're just going to need this guy. What's your emergency? Hello? There was a robbery. Where did this happen? Around. <laughs> How convenient. Do you have any injuries? No, I think we're fine. Are your attackers still in the area? They took a car and drove away. Can you describe the car? It was a white sedan, but I didn't see the plate. How long ago did this happen? We'll take care of it. Just wait for emergency services to arrive. Yeah, I will. Good search. Notification. Good search. All right, 10 for Thank you. 1125. Can you go see the radio room? All right, 10 for We got 0156. Gun raid. Okay. And our SWAT team is currently busy. Um. How long do you got? Seven seconds. How long do you got? 18 seconds. Uh, okay, we're just going to see what we got. Okay, motorcycle. You're on any down there. You're going there. As soon as you get three, you're going to help out this. Okay, come help out, please. 
All right, that's what five officers. Hopefully, that's enough. I'm gonna leave the ambulance close in case we need it. All right, you need to come down here somewhere. Actually, you you come help out here too. For now, gun raid sounds scary. Send everybody. Uh, unconscious. You help there. Okay, we've we've got a lot of officers now. That's not enough officers, and I don't know what is. All right, this is a drug overdose. You go help that. You probably need to come transport them. We're done here. Reporting. Heading over there. I guess I don't need the SWAT team. Okay, we do need you though. Actually, we might have more injuries than it's just. What are the orders? Can you not go? Okay. I, just, I think I hit the wrong button. 911, what's your emergency? A murder has been committed. Where did this happen? Who's the victim? It's my wife. Could you send the police here? How did it happen? It was a... We had an argument. It was self-defense. What do you mean by self-defense? She had a knife. Do you have a weapon? Yeah, I have a gun. You're going to need to put the gun away, okay? Yes, I'll... I'll put it on the table. I'm nowhere near the gun. Stay where you are, wait for the police. They're going to be there shortly. They'll take care of this. Okay, I'll wait. Thank you. So you guys are all good, right? Yeah. Um, an epilepsy attack. Okay, you head over there. Requesting medical. Reporting. Heading over there. We need an ambulance on my way to hospital. Is thing still going down? Kind of, yeah, I guess. Wow. Got injured. Going to hospital. Medical heading to hospital. Alright, that took a lot. Um, childbirth. What are the orders? Alright, fire truck. Go help with the childbirth, I guess. I'm listening. Oh, wait, you... Are you okay? I think you're gonna be okay. All right, we'll need medical over here. Ready for the next case. Reporting. Ten four. You head up there. All right, spread the police cars back out again. Waiting. Understood. Speaking of police cars, drunk driver. You head up there. Guess you're transporting the the guy that killed his wife. Um, you need to head up there. Are you able to help with the childbirth? Yeah, you are. Nine one one. What's your emergency? Hello. There's an unconscious man here on the pavement. Where are you calling from? Around. Did you see him pass out? Does he have any visible injuries? A black eye, and there's some blood on his face. Is he breathing? Yes. Breath smells so bad. I'm sending an ambulance. Okay, thanks. 2247 West Monroe. E39 is going to be a 91. I'm going to pick up an intox. Audio. I'm on the desk. Okay, ambulance. Get over there. Uh, you're heading up there. Where's my other ambulance? Reporting. Understood. Understood. Okay. You're... Reporting. Right away. You go there. Okay. 
Um, wish you guys help inter uh, uh, interrupt that. Man putting a needle in his arm. Head there. Alright, let's spread these guys out a little bit. Alright, you head down here. Police stuff. Drug dealer. Okay, let's send a police car. Rush will head down there. Alright, we're getting medical transport for you. Drunk driver, we're going to need a police car to pick you up. You might need to head there, actually. We're done here. 911, what's your emergency? Help! My kitchen is on fire! Where are you calling from? What's on fire? Oil in the frying pan. Okay. Do you have a fire extinguisher? No. I feel like damp towels for oil. I can't remember. Okay. Get yourself at anyone else. I can't else remember. I should figure. I should probably look that up. <laughs> I honestly don't remember. <laughs> I know you don't put water on it. That's the only thing I know. <laughs> don't put water on oil in the fire. Fine, but I just don't remember if the damp rag works. Um. I don't really have a lot of options here. I guess we'll send the SWAT team to the dog bite. And they have medical too, don't No, no, they don't have medical. I guess we'll send the fire truck for the medical side of things. Or we'll send you. That'll work. Everything else looks okay. Alright, this is a pedestrian hit. You need to head over there. Okay. Place transport needed, we'll head you there. Uh, you're going there, that's fine, okay. Let's just, as soon as you get done, you go help the, actually, no, you help the pedestrian. You stay over here. Alright, you get a little more centrally located. You head over this way. Alright, that's the end of the ship, so we'll just get these last couple done and we're done. Cool. All right, not too bad. I mean, yeah, I think it was all right. Definitely just wish we had more units, but I mean, obviously more units just cost money. A lot of people getting promoted. A couple injuries, though. That's, that's unfortunate. How bad are the injuries? Three days, one day. Okay. All right, we're going to put a cut in there when we come back. Uh, more of the same, honestly. Like I said, we're on, I uh, can barely sit up there. We're on chapter four still, so we still got six more chapters. So this actually is going to be quite a bit longer series than I than I thought it would be. Um, probably at least 10 episodes then uh, at the rate we're going right now. So that's fine. I mean, I need content. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. And I'm having fun. I think this is kind of a cool game. So again, hopefully you guys are still enjoying it. Um, let me know how you feel in the comments below. And if you don't enjoy it, don't worry. There'll be another series here in a, not too long. So <laughs> I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you. And I hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.